and welcome back to the Elder Scrolls Online and to Vulcal Guard, where we have a quest for the Prophet to go and talk to the Vulcal Guard mages. Last time we saved Abner Than from um, his imprisonment, so to say, in Cold Harbor, and we squared off against Menimarko himself, though in a weak and disembodied form. Before we head to um, to Valenwood, I think the it's um, we're gonna clear out at least a couple of more uh, a couple of more of uh, of the main story uh, missions, uh, so to say, so that maybe around episode 41, 42, depending on how these. Um, Oh, we got Abnathan in here. I think I have checked the bookshelves in here, but just to be safe. Okay. So we got... Gil Savant. What have we got here? We can see... Why would there be a book on mace etiquette in the Mages Guild? Oh well. Alchemy station, I don't have... I have one al alchemical reagent, which is not enough to perform alchemy. Enchanting table? I suppose we could look at that. Uh, anything that I don't know, I don't know that, but I can't use it. Don't know... No, there's nothing that I don't know that I can use. Wow, aspect improvement 4. That's a long way down the line before I can use that for anything. Oh yeah, I forgot I had made Flabby bigger. Ah, Aptathon. Hello. Ah, excellent. You got my message. Apparently that little creature isn't completely useless. Banekin can be such children. I hope you've nothing pressing. We could be here a while. Thon, why are you dressed I like that? I can't be strutting around the city wearing my imperial regalia, can I? Your concern about my fashion sense is touching but irrelevant. Well, I... I've called you here for a reason. If we are to determine a course of action, we need more information. What are you talking about? By now, it should be clear your prophet emperor brought these catastrophic events upon us. Everything that transpired is his fault. Menemarko deceived him. It wasn't Pardon? his fault. Menemarko can be very persuasive and charismatic when he wants to be. We all believed him when he said we could change Varen's bloodline with the Amulet of Kings. Then why do you blame Varen? You Baron? saved Varen's life when you rescued him in Cold Harbor. In return, he lied to you about his true identity and his part in causing the soul burst. He manipulated you from the very start. Perhaps the better question is, why don't you blame Varen? Just tell me why you call wants me. to assemble a new group of companions in the vein of the original five. Claims it fulfills a prophecy in those wretched scrolls of his. Superstitious nonsense, but he is quite correct on one point. We need to find Sai Sahan. Why? Why is Sai Sahan so In the important? chaos following the soul burst, Sahan stole the Amulet of Kings and fled the Imperial City. We're going to need that relic, and he is the only one who knows its current location. Where is Sai Sahan now? He's by Minimarko's agents and taken to an undisclosed location. We need to find out where he's being held. What do you need me to do? Minimarko keeps his most secret documents in a hidden lair of Daedric cultists deep within the Grantwood, in the ruins of Wormroot Depths. We must travel there and search for clues. I'll set out at once and meet you Remember, there. Wormroot Depths, Grantwood. I'll meet you inside. I have... I have if some I can endure Titanborn's inane prattle, I can survive your assuredly erudite elucidations. Proceed. Uh, what will happen to you ah, now? There's the rub. With my untimely defection, my family will likely be divested of its holdings. The name Tharn is probably being stricken from every document in the Imperial Archives as we speak. I detest being on the wrong side of history. Have you really lost everything? This is a setback, nothing more. By allying with you, 
I will liberate the Empire from Menemato's grip. The Empire is all that matters to me. I will do what I must to ensure its survival. All right. Uh, isn't your daughter the Empress Regent? Trivia. She is comfortably lodged in Manamarco's pocket, along with my nephew, Jabard. I doubt they've given my disappearance a second thought. Ah, fair Trivia. My charming girl grew to be a ruthlessly ambitious woman. I taught her well. Goodbye. Okay, so this is a bit uh, unplanned, um, but because of its because there is an auto save system and it only allows for one save slot where is the exit um i cannot go in and do this mission to know what's going to happen ahead of time so actually we shall travel to uh to Grafwood, which is in valonwood so, maybe it's time we said goodbye to Oregon. Well, at least not goodbye, but perhaps mm, perhaps see you another time. Okay, let's see. What what travels to Grasswood? Not that one. Uh, not that one. How about this one? Ah. Not sure what that uh, argument was about. I don't really care either. Alright. Well. Let's see if we can find a boat. So we want to zoom out. Our current quest will take us Oh, so the dock in Skywatch. Now we could ride or walk the way to Skywatch. And uh, I could talk about a lot of things that I know or don't know about. But I think the fastest route is to take the Way Shrine. It's why they're there. And it doesn't cost me anything. And... Well, there's a ray shrine outside of Skywatch, so that's an obvious choice, at least to me. And people haven't loaded in for some reason. Uh, no. I don't give a shit about you wanting to duel. Uh, that was not what I wanted to click. Notifications. Uh, nope. I don't have time to duel. I'm doing a video. Want to sell items to other players? Guilds have built in stores. Join a guild and sell your items to other members. Hmm. That's kind of nice. And I might, way, way down the line, uh, look at it and maybe do something about it. So we have actually multiple quests here in Skywatch. The first one seems to be to talk to Captain Jimile. And since she is on the way to finishing our main quest, we might as well talk to her now. I don't think... Captain Jimile is... Here. Hello. It's good to see you, friend. You will always have a place aboard the Prowler. Queen Aren said you could take me to the Port of the Haven. Queen? Of course we can do this. We shall set out for Haven at once, if you are ready. Where is your Where ship? We left it, I'd hope. But come, join me for a drink. It's good luck to share a glass before a long voyage. Unless you can't handle this stuff. Then you can meet us in Wulkelgar. Hmm. Alright, I have time for drink. friendly wager. We match each other, glass for glass. Win, and you travel to Haven in the privacy of your own cabin. But if I win, you launder our clothes for the entire voyage. Deal? Mm. If you buy the drinks, we have a deal. Deal. Bottoms up. 
And speaking of bottles, I don't know how to how to do this if it were. Fold in his breeches. Ready when you are. So did I win? Ah. Uh, how? So, did I win, or what happened? Wait. What is that sound? Huh. Well. Well, probably not important. Eh. You can hear the ancestors whisper. So now we actually... Oh, yes, Captain Jamila was on the boat, so now we can actually... Mm. Well, there are multiple ways to get to... Um, to Craftwood. And seeing as we're now in Skywatch, and it seems we have a lot of quests that c could... that collude here, we might as well take the opportunity to use the docks of... Um, uh, the water will use a boat here. Seems like it's down here. Yep, there's the marker. I'll have to make another thumbnail because this one for Oridon isn't quite fitting. Scout Lini Mundil. Hello. Need passage boat between swing. Oridon and Grotwood? I have a deal with some privateers. They'll take us across the lane free of charge. Say the word and I'll row us out to meet them. Alright, I'm ready to go to Crowdwood. This region is the southern heart of the Wood Elves Great Forest and home to more of the gigantic graph oaks than in any other part of Valenwood. Its capital, now also the capital of the entire Amiri Dominion, is Elden Root. We shall definitely take a look at that. Hmm. Perhaps I was supposed to land in Haven first. Oh well. We'll see to it once we get to Grathwood. Okay, so where are we? This is... Oh, we actually landed in Haven. I... I haven't discovered that, have I? Alright, so we have Elden Root. What is that? Red fur. That's probably Khajiit. That looks interesting. There's a settlement of some sort that doesn't have a name. So, only things we really have to... This is probably a ruin. So, only things we really have to go for is Elden Root, which is just down the road, fairly close by, it seems. And Haven. And Haven is pretty much right here. All right. Well, uh, can I talk to you again? Need passage between Oridon and Grotwood. Oh, uh. All right, so this is a new world. Well, not a new world, but it's definitely... Oh. Okay, so there's plenty of quest markers here. So pretty much it's all about getting started and... Wait, did I level up from that? Not entirely. Oh, that reminds me, I should probably get a experience scroll going. Oh, I already have it going. Good. You there? Got that. From the ship. Le Lieutenant Kazagi. Brother, here in Haven, they sail with the gold fleet. They picked a poor time to visit this fair city. What do you mean? A unit came here with a speaker for the main. A great honor to travel in his company, to visit the capital of the Dominion. But it seems pirates captured Haven. They must have overwhelmed the defenders. Tell me what happened. How it happened? Lord Garashri brought my unit to Haven as part of our final training. But when we arrived, the city was under pirate attack. We worked with the fisher folk to help the citizens escape. Who attacked Haven? A pirate band that raids throughout the long coast. But how could one pirate ship do so much damage? They shouldn't have taken the city at all, let alone as quickly as they did. 
Can I do anything to help? locate General Andare, but we could find no sign of her garrison. He feels the city's defense is our responsibility. But there are few of us. Please, find Lord Gareshri. Help take Haven back from the pirates. Where can I find Lord Gareshri? I... I... do not know. Not exactly. I only know what I must protect. But Lord Gareshri spoke with some refugees before he left. The merchant Naren and Kurinwe, who leads the fisher folk. Perhaps they would know. I'll find out what they know. All right, well, seems we have a quest. We have people to talk with, and everything is new and wonderful. Gaius Fang. So there's someone called Gaia here who apparently. Ha oh, Curl Paul, hello. Pirates or not, I have wares to move. Schedules don't keep themselves. Oh, goodbye. Up! Oh, in company of wood orcs. Law book discovered! Woo! Oh yeah, that, yeah, that, yeah, that should be said. Since we have found all the law books and all the location on Oridon, this is a whole new place! There are tons of law books and tons of treasures. These are, ah, these, oh, these are fighters guild. Lekele Caprinia. It certainly Hello. seems like we've got some impossible. Ah, I don't want to... All right, you know the beachfront is a good place for treasure. Washed up parts of... Ooh, that's cool. Someone been target practicing with that barrel. Whoa, gator! We got a gator. Lie down and die, gator. What do you have on you? Steel battle axe of frost. Cool. Oh, I've also cleared out my inventory. Uh, I could sell it if nothing else. All right. So these are the trees of Grathwood. Interesting. Let's actually just take a look. Oh, God, God damn crocodiles. I don't have time for your shit. Get out of here. Gosh dang it. All right. Uh, let's, uh, oof, what was that? That looked nasty. So this is where we are, Grathwood. Oh yeah, Kanati's roof. We've been there. A nice place. So we've done Oridon. And is now in Grathwood. Wonder why we didn't go to Green Shade first. Oh well. What have we got here? Horbor. Sounds problematic. Oh, you seem important. Corinne, oh, you were one of those I was supposed to talk to. How could pirates capture the largest port on the long coast without a fight? Have you seen Lord Kareshi? Passed through on the way to Haven. Seemed more concerned with retaking the city than rescuing its people. That's unkind. Some of my fisherfolk tried to sneak back inside to bring family and friends. Too few have returned. Do you know where Lord Kareshri was going? He gave a big speech about throwing the pirates back into the sea. Almost believed he could do it with his handful of soldiers. Cross the marsh and head for Haven's outer ward. You'll find signs of the Cat Lord, I'm sure of it. Oh, that sounds like a cool title, Cat Lord. What can you tell me about the marsh? Critters, but some good fishing on the seaside. We usually head there in pairs. One to fish, one to watch for Horvor. Don't let your guard down. Can you tell me what happened in Haven? In our camp, bedding down for the night, saw a big ship sail right up. No challenge from the Dockmaster. I took a boat out, paddled carefully, then I saw jackdaws pouring onto the docks. Oh, goodbye. 
All right. So there's also, obviously, since it's a new area, oh, no there's also happens, new alchemical reagents. Our commitment to the Fighters Guild. Yeah, sure, sure. I can't imagine chainmail would be very pleasant. I, I imagine this place to be very humid, and I don't think that leather and chainmail would be a very good combo for that kind of weather. Oh, hey, what? wasn't there a guy over here before? Huh. Perhaps it was. Alright, well, it seems we have gotten ourselves started. I don't think there is any more to do here on Fisherman I Fisherman's Isle. So, it mm, seems we have to head through the swamp. I'd rather than not, but... Okay, so these are Horvar. An unknown territory. Flappy's still with us? Good, good. Horvar. See, that one over there worries me. That is much bigger than these. I don't know what it is. What are these Horvar? That looks... That looks nasty. One down. Apparently not too fussed about lightning. Okay, what do you have? Carapace. Well, alright. Okay. So, runestone. I don't really care about that right now. Alright, so what is that thing over there? A strangler. That sounds unpleasant. It's a plant of some sort, it seems. All right then, well, it's a big plant. All right, well, let's try and take it out. Perhaps I should have used fire. Whoa! That was unpleasant. It doesn't really do damage when it pulls you in like that, so it's not that dangerous, but Steel Helm, Supple Root, Sells a Merchant for, uh, for Gold, yes. Did we level up? No, but we are very, 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 very close to it. Another... Yes, Flabby is seen here as well. I've got a person over here. Trying to avoid the horrors. I can level up in due time. How are you doing? I thought running an inn would be safer than sailing a merchant scow. And yet pirates, always pirates. I was what happened? Some supplies. I plan to meet with a trader to restock. Then pirates. Everyone ran in different directions. I heard some screams out in the marsh, but I twisted my ankle. Who was screaming? Workers, they're like family. The kind that doesn't know their way around a marsh. Not like you. Hey, if you run across them, would you mind keeping them safe? Especially Kazuli, my cook. As long as she's alright, I'll be alright. I'll look for your workers. Lost treasures. Sounds like a movie pitch that's about to happen. So we got horrors in the water, we got stranglers on the on the land. Everything is horrible. Welcome to Valenwood. <laughs> okay. There's another strangler over there and a strangler there. I'm not entirely sure what I'm looking for. Well, obviously there's a way to go straight up ahead with Haven being right there. But I want to scour this marsh so that I don't have to return to it ever again unless I need to take a boat. You know what? Oh. Hmm. Let's try a bit of flame. So, different stuff then. Oh. Sabouche! Do not pull Flappy in like that. She doesn't like being grabbed. Trust me, I've tried. Oh! Well. 
That was our level and character rewards. Still a volunteer. Yes, I'm fine with that. Off balance. <coughs> oh, we have two. Prophet's Maul, Prophet's Bow, Prophet Lightning Staff, Prophet Shield. I ain't never seen the Prophet wield an axe. Uh, sure, let's get this. Oblivion damage. Cool. Okay, so we got two, so let's put uh, one in Magicka and one in Health. Alright, we also got two skill points. Okay, let's see, Dark Magic, what do we got? Persistence, what is that? After blocking an attack, your next Stamina or Magicka ability costs 70% less. That's kind of nice, I tend to block quite a lot, so... Unholy Knowledge. Oh yeah. This is all abilities, so that's... That's really good. What else have we got? Anything that can be morphed? Nah, doesn't seem like... Daedric Summoning. Daedric Curse? Nah, not really interested. Rebate. Uh, Flappy is weaker than, uh, than Scampy was, but... Ooh, I can morph Overload. Power Overload. Charge your fist with the power of the storm. Light attacks become lightning bolts, dealing 5,911 shock damage. Oh! And heavy attacks blast enemies in the target area for 2,300 shock damage. Attacks deplete, ultimate, yeah, yeah. Energy overload, what's the difference? So that restores magicka. Light effects and heavy effects restore magicka, but has less bonus damage. Increase range. I think I'm going for that. All right, that was a point to that. Cool. Level twenty-five, and we got the prophet's lightning staff. Let's take a look at that right away. Uh, no. Prophet. Hmm. Oh, that's a destruction staff. Well, we don't want to be using that as a main weapon. We want to have it as an offhand. There we go. Oh, that looks cool. All right. Well, um, hmm. this would be an awkward place to end this episode. So I don't. Let us actually let us find these. Um... Let's see. So, workers in the marsh, they are somewhere within the marsh. Okay. There's one. Tavern worker, yeah. Alright, so let's... Uh... Eh, I don't need to... Yeah, the lightning doesn't give me a shield though, which is kind of unfortunate. But I like the more damage. It is very powerful. I need to get out of this place. I can't thank you enough. Yeah, that's probably not a bad idea. All right. So where is the last one? So we are probably looking for stranglers rather than horrors. That could look like it over there. Just have to dodge and weave between these horrors. I'm not afraid of them, they're just somewhat annoying. Is that a tavern worker? Or is it? Yeah, could look like it. Well, you totally missed on that one, did you? So, with when you use a heavy attack with a lightning staff, it just it deals more damage with the last one. Like zap. Ran to Haven for help. If you see her, Kazooie. tell her we're safe. Okay, can do. Well, that, hmm. Hmm. Perhaps that tree has some hollow. See, if I were to place a treasure up, oh, hello. 
Gold lockpick, large stolen shipment. Yoink! I have to find the thieves guild here. As the thieves guild was added after I played on um, on a computer where I didn't get very far. Um, I have no idea where the thieves guild is here in Valenwood or in this region. But obviously. If and when I come across illegal items, I will need somewhere to fence it off. Right now, we're just scouring the place for treasures and other valuable items. Ooh, can I actually... Haven discovered. Well, not how I intended that to go, but... Ah, there's a strangler. But it's hidden. It's trying to be clever. But it's not. It's dead. Pop! Good, yeah. It's actually good that it does that because it really it misses. Ah! Whoop! Oh, there! The stranglers are not so bad. They are scary to look at, but considering that they don't do damage when they pull you in like that. I was about to say, that doesn't even like the best place to place a... So that's Haven Way Shrine. I've seen no treasure chest out here and that makes me a little sad. Oh, that, that bug have killed a man. Or a woman. Hmm. Really? No treasures? I say, I say, this is a problem. I heard you. I see that. I do not like it. Woo -hoo. It's uh, quite efficient, this uh, lightning staff. I'm more of a defensive player, so the shield is more, the, the ice shield is more my way to go, really. Oh, so when you're close enough, it can actually uh, attack you. Ah! I see. Well, it doesn't make them any less nasty, but it does make them... I don't know. Really? No treasure chests. In all this marsh. And nothing. Not even a... Oh. Nerid Empress. I'm not sure what this is about, but I'm going to fight it. Nerid. Uh, you know what? I don't know how powerful these are, but I have, a te have to test out my new skill. Whoop! Whoop! Woohoo! Whoa! Cross damage. Unpleasant. One of them down. Are these ghosts or what are they? Nerid. No, they look very, 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 very real. Actually. Ooh, forgot I had that ability. So, what are they about? What a hyacinth? Nope. A rune stone. That is not what I was looking for. Hmm. Hello. Yep. So, how about treasures, yeah? Those Horvars are... Is that a pewter seam? It is. Alright, don't really care about that. I've gone around in a circle. Hmm. And not found a single treasure chest. All right, all right. I think the marsh is... You do not get to attack me. I don't think these bugs have any ranged attacks to speak of, but... So I'll just kite this one around and... There's some... Some wood that I don't care about. Ha-ha! <laughs> okay, that's not good. Chris 
pistol in your face. They don't take take a lot of damage from lightning, eh? It's kind of strange, but I suppose fire would be better at beating bugs. Either way, it's dead now. Ha! Huh. So no treasures, eh? Well, that does definitely put a damper on my mood. Unless... Nope. That was just a runestone. And I have plenty of runes as it is. Enchanting more. I could probably do well at it, but... I don't really care much for about my about that. Well, I guess this is a good place to stop, to stop this uh, episode. So, next time, we shall enter Haven, and then we shall try and save the city in this new and undiscovered area. But until then, take care.